We expect SADA grads to be good partners and capable of participating in an economy that respects the rights of Indigenous people, which is why we see it as really important to be building this content into our curriculum. When you think about the BMO gift, it's an organization in the private sector that's making society better, specifically when we think about you know, the Aboriginal issues and the Aboriginal questions. UBC wants to be part of that, and so in, in some ways it's a nice partnership. We're trying to bring Indigenous content into the program in a number of different ways. So the projects, the reports, some of the assignments that the students are doing, we're trying to theme them with Indigenous issues. A second way that we're trying to add this content into the program is by having a course that's specifically devoted, let's say, to joint ventures with Indigenous communities. And lastly, you know, some of the extracurricular events, like the case competitions. Three years ago, we decided to use a First Nations case study. The students find these cases very different from more typical case studies that they would encounter in their classrooms. I had met a Souter representative and just indicated that Kanaka Bar had started a path of recovery. And I was asked to put together an industry case. We had hoped by sharing Kanaka Bar's story that they would actually help us identify what our opportunities were and how we could make them happen. So as a result, they're saying, maybe you should look at solar. So since then, Kanaka Bar has installed four solar projects. Maybe you should look at producing your own honey. Kanaka Bar now has three beehives. So that was really, really powerful for us. I think it's very important for people to be aware of the privileges that they have and to understand like, how your actions might be a result of something not so great that has happened in the past. It's been nice to learn business in an environment that really encompasses that social impact aspect. Even though you can look at the bottom line at the end of the day, it's like, what are you really doing with that money to make sure that everyone in the community is getting some aspect of the benefit from it? Improving access for students that come from an Aboriginal background is, is important. And by providing support for them, we can make the transition to the university, specifically a place like UBC, easier and more successful for them. When I got it, I was really excited and I called my dad right away and he was super happy and then I called my mom and I was just really proud. I didn't think I could receive such an award and yeah, I was really proud of myself. Now that I got this award, I feel like less financially burdened. I would like to thank them for offering me this opportunity, this scholarship. It gives opportunities to students who don't have a chance otherwise. We are endeavoring to build better partners, better citizens, and build the economy of BC. We see this as a really important part. We shared our story, but we also shared BC's story and Canada's story. In exchange, I got back their story, and that changed me.